And now we turn to the Weather Authority forecast with Violet. And it's rather soggy and cool once again. Really not much has changed since yesterday. Yeah. And the rain looking to stick around as well. So if you did have any plans to do anything, definitely want the umbrella. Rain is over Syracuse and mainly for areas west of I-81, but this is building in from the southwest. So if you do live across the southern tier by Cortland, Norwich, Hamilton, Rome, and Utica, you should be seeing the rain shortly. And notice it's generally light, but there are some little yellow pockets beginning to pop here or there across the Finger Lakes by Geneva and Penn Yen. So there may be some moderate pockets as we go through this evening, but in general, Cloudy with light rain this evening, tonight, and even early tomorrow morning. Now, the center of this system is still far to our west. Notice this wide shield of clouds and rain. That'll be sticking around. Tomorrow, we may get some peaks of sun, and that'll fire up some new pop-up showers for the afternoon as well. But the risk for storms along the back side of this system arrives Wednesday night and heading into Thursday. So if you're planning on getting the lawn done, we will have some dry time between the showers. Looking iffy Wednesday, Thursday though, by the afternoon we dry out. And it's looking to stay quiet for the weekend, at least as of right now. We're keeping eyes on Tropical Storm Helene, which may impact our weather heading into later this weekend. Timing this out with your future cast. Right now we have showers building in from the southwest. Cloudy with temperatures in the mid 60s. Really not cooling down too much tonight. Only bottoming out in the upper 50s by sunrise. Along with these scattered showers still continuing on and off into the bus stop forecast. So make sure the kids have the umbrella if they're waiting for the bus in the morning. We should get some more dry periods towards the middle of the day on Wednesday. And some peaks of sun, which will warm us up into the lower 70s. But also that's going to spark a few scattered showers popping up for the afternoon and the evening once again. Wednesday night, a cold front heads in on the back side of this system. As I mentioned, that's going to spark some scattered thunderstorms during the overnight early Thursday morning, looking to exit east by midday Thursday and by about lunchtime. Most of the rain should be heading out by late afternoon, totally dry, and we could even see some sun towards sunset. Heading into Friday, still looking quiet as well. But as I mentioned, we are watching southwest. This is the remnants of tropical storm Helene, which will become a hurricane as we go over the next couple of days and then weaken as it gets closer to us. So we'll just be seeing the remnants of this system, which could bring us some extra clouds on the edge of it and potentially some rain showers late in the weekend, not until maybe late Sunday or Monday. Still a little bit iffy about the track of this because that is so far away. So again, scattered showers for tomorrow, dry periods in between lower 70s, mid 70s with morning storms Thursday, dry afternoon afternoon quiet for Friday mid 70s still dry for now in the mid 70s for the weekend and then upper 70s to start next week could see the remnants of a lean looking towards next week as well. Thanks Violet.